out here in the in the rain, thunder. Here's a couple of chanchillas right here. That one, I don't know what's going on with that one. It's almost like someone picked that one and wasn't sure what it was or something. But. One beautiful specimen right there. You see how they got little tiny gills, but they don't have any gills like compared to other mushrooms. I think they're called false gills or something like that. But it's definitely a chanterelle. This one is too. I don't know what happened to it. I will take it. Alright. It's always good to, to circle around once you find one. I generally just set the bucket down next to the one I've seen. And like right here, there's three of them. And do a circle. There's one, two, three right there. Oh, really? They can actually hide pretty good on you. That's a nice one right there. These are all really, really fresh. Alright, come on. I just like to, to cut that dirt off there. There's no point in having having dirt in the bucket. Okay. They always seem to grow wherever this green grass is. I always find them around here. Wherever this like this green green grass. They always seem to go over by them. Alright. Got over a half dozen, so let's see if we can go find some more. I found some about 50 yards that way, and I found these ones. Just scattered all through here. Just along this, this open hardwoods, and it's more thick right here. I've been following it, and here's another one. Another sand trail. That's a nice one right there. If they're in a cluster, I'd have videoed them, but some nice ones. So I'm just gonna do a circle through here and see what else I find. Oh, well, here's one right here. I don't have my knife, so I'll just grab these and I'll trim them when I get back to my bucket. Might have to go back and get my bucket. I'll just keep looking. It's just mixed hardwoods. Generally, if you find a few morel hunt, they pretty much grow up in the same same woods, pretty much wherever you find morels. That's what they say. I found morels here, so it seems to be true. I'll just keep looking. Turn you back on if I find some more. Uh, maybe 15 yards later, I'm starting my loop to go back through there. And they stick out like a sore thumb. Oh, there's a few. A couple right here. That's a nice one right there. There are some mushrooms that look pretty similar, but you can tell by the by the gills. Yeah. This is starting to oh, turn out pretty darn good. Alright, let's look for more. Maybe 10 yards from the other one. There's another one right there. And look at those ones. 
Those are some chunky ones right there. Alright. Now we're getting somewhere. I guess I'll grab this one right here. Or there's, I'll grab these ones, I should say. They break off pretty easy. But, yeah, look at that beautiful one. These things are nice. Alright, let's keep her moving. I need both my hands, so I'll be right back. I've walked maybe 10 more foot. I see them right there. Oh, shoot, I just dropped some. I'll just leave those. That's what I've gathered so far. Right there. This camera doesn't do it justice, but I mean, these ones are hiding from me. Yeah. I'm gonna go get my bucket. And make it, this is where I drop my bucket off. I mean, look at those ones. This one on the right looks a little goofy, but I think it's one of them. It's just big. Oh yeah, look at that one. You can imagine these skeeters or something else right now. Whew. All right, now we gotta go hunt our way back. It's like this side of the hill and they're just growing all along it. We got cherry trees, we got oak trees. We got dead. That kind of looks like I don't know what type that is anymore. But we got all these elm trees. There's big trees, little trees. They like mix hardwoods. And around this water down there, that's all water. They like growing around that too. All right, I gotta get moving. These mosquitoes or something else. Look at these ones. There's actually three here. Tender little things. I'll grab him too while I'm at it. Alright. Alright, I finally made it back here. Young ones. They start out as tiny little buttons. These things take a while to grow. Whoop. That's gonna, you know, I'm gonna trim the dirt off those. But, all right. Just looking. Sometimes I like to get up on top of the hill like this and just look down. And if you look right there, you'll see why. It's kind of hard to see them, but on the camera at least. I mean, we got this one right here. Thank you. Don't mind if I do. I'm not even really back to my good spot either. Alright, let's keep them looking. Another pair. Another pair right up there. Right there. It's weaving back and forth through the sticker stuff. Well, there's more than one. There's one right there. Two. Three. Oh, 
Oh, this one's older. Okay. I mean, it still ain't bad, though. Unlike that thing, I mean, that thing's like... Almost perfect. This one is just really nice. Some really nice mushrooms this year. That's because it's so wet. Alright. And ba bam ba bam There's three. Oh, there's another one. Another one right there. Alright, let me see. Uh, I don't see any more. It's not always like this. <laughs> These things are nice. Ooh. That's got to be like the the main thing to bring. And I got a water down there too. Especially on a wet day like today. It, it's kind of weird where that thing was growing. Right, right where this this tree right here fell. Let's stack them up. Alright. Got some nice ones here. There's two, three. This is the one. They even get bigger than this. I ain't found any. I think this might be the biggest one. Yeah, maybe not. That's a nice one, though. That's the bucket. Got a couple of those blight mushrooms too. Probably give those give those a try, see what they're like. They're all over this woods. Get back to one of my favorite spots now. You see this little guy. Pretty sure that's yeah it is. They come over here. <coughs> One, two, there's another one right there. <coughs> oh. I tried to swallow a mosquito. There's two down there, right next to each other. There's another one right there. There's some more. Two. There's a couple more. And there's three more. This woods is just infested this year. <coughs> I just... I just stumbled upon this one. And that's a really nice one too. We're getting full. I looked up here. You can't really see them on the on the camera for some reason. But see this is how you start to load them up when you start finding them like that. And the fours. And then I looked over here, there's another one, there's two more, there's a whole pile right here, they're small, yeah, I might leave some of these. And, what else? Uh, start, starting to get, oh, there's some right there. It's 
starting to get a little hard to see. Got one right there. Another one right there. Oh, look at those ones. Ooh, there's two, three, four, five. Ooh, look at those. <laughs> oh. There's there's like five more right there. Like I found where the Chantrell outbreak started. There's one. There's two. <coughs> There's another one right there. Great. <clears throat> but there's two more. There's a nice cluster right there. And there's some two nice ones right here. Awesome. Uh-huh. There's another one. Are you serious? I guess I don't know. You just ooh, that's a big one. Oh, look at that. There's like four right there. And this guy right here. Oh, he's oh. Look at that. I'm gonna grab this one too while I'm at it. That's just gonna get ruined right there. I found the biggins. This is what I've been looking for. See, that was actually old. Mmm. Yeah, I'll eat that one. That's a nice little tender one right there. I don't know, I guess I could just keep going and going and going. I don't see an end to them. I'm gonna have to come back. But that's probably gonna wrap up this one. It's starting to, I know it's starting to get hard to see. Tell you, I got enough. Definitely enough for dinner or two. Ugh. I'm gonna leave that like that. And we'll see what that looks like either tomorrow or a couple days from now. I haven't even really got back to my good spot. I mean, that bucket's about full. It's actually pinch off pretty easy. All right. All right, well, thanks for watching.